Hello, everybody. Welcome to Minami Chitose. This is the main station from the airport that will take you either to Sapporo or to Kushiro. And this is the express train from the from the airport going from going from the airport to Sapporo right now. And I just took that, and I'm going behind all these people here. I guess they're also going to tour to catch the Ozora. Oh, I'm so excited about this. How are you doing, everybody? I have about um, 15 minutes before the train comes in. I just returned a rental car, had driven up to Yabari for the uh, Hokkaido Melon Auction, which is pretty awesome. Uh, now I'm going off to the next job to film in Kushido and Nemuro, which is on the extreme east. I guess there's east and extreme east because you can't go any more east than that. And this train will take you all the way to Kushido. Uh, I, I'm gonna give you a lot of information about the Azora. Let's get up to that platform and maybe we can get an Ekiben. Let's see what's here at Minami Kikose. I was hoping for a more, a better weather day, but it looks like it's kind of crummy. There's some massive storm warnings in Tokyo right now, lots of lightning. But we make do with the weather that we got. It's cool enough in Hokkaido that I actually need a jacket. Look at this. This is not summer. Here's the ticket that I got. It is um, kind of pricey, almost 9,440 yen from here to Kushido, and it takes about three hours and 30 minutes. But the Ozora takes um, three hours and 58 minutes from Sapporo to Kushido. Oh, there it is right there. So. I had to switch platforms. It's the 12.25 and we have 10 minutes. Where's the Eki Ben? I gotta leave the station. Ah, <laughs> So there's a waiting room here, and I think maybe there's something. Let's go say, let's take a look. All right, well, we got some information on the train here. It's on schedule, and this is kind of neat here. I'm in car number two, so right here. And they do have non-reserve trains, that's interesting. The first class car is right here. I wish. All right, let's go to the platform. I don't know how I would even hold the Eki Ben. Let's just say for a moment. Let's just say for a moment. I do get an Eki Ben. Where are we gonna carry it? I got a backpack. I got a luggage. I have a front bag. I have to cover it. Carry it in my mouth. All right. There is an Eki Ben shop. Oh, it's on the platform. Coolness achieved. I know someone who said that once. I wish I could take credit for a coolness achieved, but <laughs> what do I? It's on the right side here. The train will be coming in 10 minutes. All right, let's see. Hokkaido Ekiben. Look at this old Ekiben shop. Oh, we got to get something. Choices are limited to four bento. Oh, you can hear the rain coming down pretty strong. Yeah, I'm not gonna put it in there. My backpack's filled with camera gear. Oh, there's the one going the other way. Uh, 
あ何残ってるいくらホタテサーモンのしるしとあサーモンあじゃあサーモンお願いしますあ,あと大きめしあいくらあそれなんですねあとホタテじゃあホタテじゃあいくらしましょういくらにしますはい美味しいですよこのいくらグッドベリーグッド美味しいですよ<笑>美味しそう<笑>はいこちら二千円お願いいたしますあ、領収書できますか。領収書ですね。はい。こちらお名前の書かなくても大丈夫ですか。はい、必要ですか、名前。名前必要ですか。会社。会社名。はい。はい。会社はあの有限会社。To get official receipts for everything. It's part of making this a job. Alright, the train is coming from this direction.、Uh, I'm in car number two. So there's a thing that you can do here. If you look up, they actually have. Whoa, melon! They actually have these letters here, and that corresponds to where you're going to be sitting as well if you've looked at the. At the、uh, Um, live stream before. I don't remember what letter it was. But that helps you find your seat so when the train comes, you can get on really quickly.、Um, I wasn't paying attention to that, so. I'm guessing the front is this way, and I'm pretty close to the front. I don't really care about getting wet. Oh. So, this is the bento. That's nice. She gave me some、uh, chopsticks here. It's the Ikura bento. Wow, the weather's really bad. The weather is really bad. <laughs> this, tra this train ticket cost me, again, I don't have a JR Rail Pass, so it, it cost me about $85. But if I were to drive to Kushido from here, It would cost me more than that. In gasoline, in toll, and the car rental, driving is really expensive. So, train tickets, although it seems like it's, it's, it seems expensive to, drive, to get a $120 ticket from Tokyo to Kyoto, actually, if you were to drive down there, it'd be more like $200. Because the tolls are ridiculous, the gas prices are high, and that's up my queue. So, I decided I'm going to take the train. I'm going to share with you the experience. I, we don't want to miss the train, though. 
Not a photo. It's coming from this direction. That's why. I, I did it in reverse. Okay, we got to skedaddle. Run this way. I don't think it stops very long here. Okay. Oh, the wind is picking up. This is the worst possible situation. I'd rather have snow. Okay, here comes... Car still rides in here, rain or shine, I love a train ride. I can get behind that. All right, the thing that stinks right here is... All right, that was the wrong train, but we, at least we know which direction it's coming from. Some people are hustling this way, so I'm getting the idea. Is that Chan? But if you drove, you might have found me. Don't oh, come on, you're not in the trunk of a rental car. Really? Turn the train around. This weather stinks. The rapid airport train for New Chitose Airport will be departing. I am at the right spot. So I should be able to get on the train pretty quick. Here comes the Ozora. I've always wanted to ride this one. This is one of the great trains. It's uh, from Sapporo to Kushido. It's 398 kilometers, I believe. Has an operating speed of 110 kilometers per hour, which I guess is what, what is that, like 60, 68 miles per hour or so? And from the airport, you would get on here at Minami Chitose. Okay. Here it comes. Here it maybe comes. Oh, there's other people taking pictures of this. This is a big deal, guys. <laughs> Katayama's like, wait for it. Wait for it. No, oh, get out of the picture! You stink a tour group guy with flag. Back away. Lady, move. Stay on the left side of the yellow line. Actually, yeah. The announcer. He's telling them, get out of the way. <laughs> Bring it. Thumbnail. Awesome! Oh my gosh, I got so many bags. Now there's not a lot of time to get on. No time to dilly dally. Alright, I'm in seat 6D. Seems like it's a it's a full house in there. Alright, for now I'm gonna Well look at this, they got power!
Alright, bye bye. Alright, I'm in seat number 6D. Let's try to get on there. Oh my gosh, it's so heavy. A lot of camera gear. ご乗車ありがとうございます。この列車は特急大空午後7時5分帯広十四時十七分終着後には十三時二十五分帯広十四時十七分終着後には十五時五十一分に到着をいたします。列車は6両編成で、先頭1号車、12番白が6号車です。指定席は前側4両、1号車から4号車で、一番前1号車は9人車となっております。また重席は白側2両、5号車の6号車です。I wanted to take a train for the nice Hokkaido view, but it looks like it's not so nice in the rain. Where are the blue skies and the wispy white clouds? 
instead we've got rain and, and soiled window. city down there um, so Hokkaido is not getting it too bad but I'll be I'll be in Kushido in about three hours or so so I'll, uh, I wish I had a maybe a cart goes through by because I'd love to get a cup of coffee and uh, just kind of enjoy the relax outside the window I'm gonna be shooting in Nemuro the Hanasaki line
window situation should have been better. Actually, I should have cleaned the windows myself before I got on. Body. This is where I live streamed uh, two days ago at the Takino Ue Park in Yubari. We're going to be rolling past there in a couple of minutes. And these uh, vinyl houses that you see, they could be melon houses or they're growing melons in there. Hey, WRS Turbos in the house. and to get a really nice experience on a train. Each one is different. This one's going at, a, at 110 kilometers an hour, which is pretty fast on these tracks. It's not made for the Shinkansen. Um, that's just the bullet train, so to say. So to say. That's what we call it, uh, the Shinkansen. This is not that, but it is um, the fastest train going to East Hokkaido. And it still takes four hours because Hokkaido is massive. And uh, I'm going to just kind of sit down and, and really enjoy this one. Um, see if I can get a coffee or something. Maybe there's a cart that goes around. Or when it, it stops at Tomamu, I might be able to run off and really quickly and get the coffee. And maybe be left behind with my luggage and camera and drone and everything up above me. That might be funny. Maybe it's just live stream all of that, right? But, yeah, that's right. I'm, I am sitting in the front away from other passengers to be respectful. These seats could be yours. You'd still have to pay $85. <laughs> something 
really magical about the train, I think. And Japan is one of the greatest countries for train riding. China is too, but they've gone to more like a super express trains. But back in the day when I was riding in, in backpacking China, the trains were... China was one of the best places to ride trains. Same with India, but maybe not now. It used to be Europe, but now everyone's flying in Europe, so train travel in Europe is not the same as it was 20 years ago. So I think the golden era of train travel in a lot of the countries have has passed. People want to get someplace faster now, but there's this really awesome feeling. You can feel, hear the diesel engine, I guess, it, uh, electric, and there's a Maybe it's half electric, half diesel, I'm not sure, because we're going out really deep into Hokkaido. I don't know if they've got electrical lines on the way. Oh, it's opening up. Beautiful.
live stream around you, bud. This is, yeah, this is it. I guess you should have gone straight a little bit more. We're in you. This is a your body area. Okay, I'm, I drove this area. Interesting. Saya's got the the melon kumai moji rocking right there. All right, guys. I hope you like rolling with me on the the Azura Ex Limited Express to Kushiro from Sapporo. Uh, if you have any questions, you can leave them in the comments below. I highly recommend this train if you have a JR Pass. There's two non-reserved cars, so you should be able to ride this with the JR Pass and really, um, I don't know, soak in Hokkaido from the windows here. Make sure you pick a sunny day because, you, as you can see, rainy days, the windows are, aren't quite as clear. But you can still lean back in the chairs and relax and enjoy the view as Hokkaido rolls by. See you in Kushiro, everybody. I'll be back in another live stream soon. watching, I sent you a Ubody melon. It's on the way. It'll come on Sunday. <laughs>